What's up everyone, it's Elliot and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So if you guys follow me on Twitter, you would have seen that I did a poll on on what you guys uh, would want to see next. It was between gaming, videos, video essays, info videos, and menswear videos. And the most voted topic was menswear videos. So today, I have a cool little menswear video that I've had on my mind for a while. So today what I'm going to be talking about specifically is longevity. Longevity is something very important when it comes to menswear shopping and when it comes to just styling overall. For me recently, because um, I used to not think about it as much, longevity has been very important to me. Whenever I shop online especially, because it's something that I feel like a lot of people don't usually think about. They usually think just in the, just in the present whenever they need to think about the future and how long you may be using a piece for. So yeah, I'm going to talk about that and then I'm going to show a couple of clothes that I think have a lot of longevity to me and that have maximized the value for me. So yeah, without further ado, let me go ahead and get on this little rant. So, longevity, what is it? Longevity is whenever you use something for a very long time. But what exactly does that mean with fashion, you know? For me, longevity means to how long you keep onto a piece for. And it's very important to have your longevity high when it comes to uh, clothes that you spend a lot of money on. Because if you spend a lot of money on something, you don't want to just wear it a couple times and then sell it for less than you got it for. Because that's not really efficient and you're not doing a very good job with longevity in that situation. For example, there's many times where I've bought clothes and I was just thinking about right then um, where I can use it with and then I might wear it with one outfit and then it might not necessarily be my style anymore and then I'll just sell it really quickly. That's something you really don't want to do because not very efficient as I just said earlier and you, you lose money a lot of the time which is something all of us definitely do not want to be doing. And it's also very important to think about with this coming uh, sale season because as you know all the uh, high fashion retailers are on sale right now, so keep longevity in mind when buying from Essence, Farfetch, all that. Even if the deals look really good, um, don't let the price fool you into something you not necessarily wouldn't spend that much money on just because it's on a big sale or whatever. Um, and especially if it's not your style and you may use it a couple times, but with clothes you really want to get as much wear out of it as you possibly can. And I feel like that's all that it really boils down to. Um, just be really smart whenever you're shopping. It's really important to not spend a lot of money on something that you may not buy. Because, you know, what's the point? There's no point um, in buying something and selling it off really fast. Um, might as well just not spend your money at all. So, yeah, please keep longevity in mind while you shop, um, whether it be in person or if it be online. Longevity is a very important skill. You have to maximize it to get the most efficient use out of your clothes. Yeah, that's all we have to say about longevity. Um, now I'm going to show you some clothes that I have maximized longevity out of and will in the future. So first off, we're going to start off with a pair of shoes. Um, these are the Endemila Meester Derbies. As you know, I'm going to show some B-roll too. Um, these are the Endemila Meester and the Patch Derbies. Um, I got these more than a year ago and I wear them so much even today. You can wear them on occasions and on just a casual day and I feel like that's a big thing with longevity. Sometimes you might just get an occasion piece or a casual piece but those pieces that you can have with both are the ones that really maximize your longevity. So yeah those are definitely the Annabella Meester Derbies. If you follow me on Instagram you'll see that I wear them a lot and see them in person you know that I wear them a lot uh, they're my favorite shoes so yeah moving on to pants and this is a pair of pants that I would recommend to almost everybody Levi's 505 jeans I have mine in the black color but they have all of all other different kinds of colors washes things like that Levi's is a really good brand to invest in because they're really cheap and they're really high quality these in particular <clears throat> just have a nice uh, a perfect fit for my style and for probably a lot of y'all style out there 
a clean straight fit that I can wear with almost anything. I wear them a lot of times with the end of Milamister Derbies. I can wear them with Air Force Ones. I can wear them with whatever, you know, Converse, whatever. Um, so yeah, these are really nice. Um, and I wear them on almost a day-to-day -day basis in the winter. Uh, because here in Texas it gets cool. It doesn't get really that cold, but it gets cool, so I can wear them a lot of the time in the winter. And I also see myself wearing it springtime, fall time, uh, whenever I dress up at night or something, I can wear these out. Um, so yeah, I would definitely check out Levi's 505 if you're looking to get into more um, essential longevity type pieces. And they're not like Acne Studios or or Helmet Lane jeans. They're not gonna cost you 150 plus. These are nice 30 to 50 dollar jeans, which is great price. Other bottom I have here is a pair of Isimiyaki pleated shorts. Uh, on Plisse, as you know, um, these are very popular, and they were they're dying down a bit, but they were really popular. A lot of the times, I don't invest in hype. Uh, because a lot of times I don't believe in it. But besides the fact these are a really nice pair of shorts that I see myself having five, ten years down the line. Um, very clean, perfect summer short and springtime as well. You can just throw these on whenever you just need to go out real quick and still look nice. You can also wear them, you know, wherever. You can almost wear these wherever uh, during the certain uh, season. But I've had these for mm, not, not a year maybe like half a year, and I still wear, still wear them on a day-to-day -day basis, and I see myself wearing them on a day-to-day -day basis in the future. Also, whenever it comes to longevity, there are some exclusive pieces you need to have in your wardrobe that are a little bit more flashy, uh, which is what I think this turtleneck right here does. Calvin Klein 205 turtleneck. This turtleneck is really clean, and it fits perfectly. You can wear this to a nice dinner, a nice brunch, if it's the right type of season. Very comfortable as well. But yeah, although this is kind of a flashy piece, it can be essential. Because I feel like everybody needs a turtleneck, um, if it's your style. This turtleneck in particular fits very nice. And I can see myself wearing it five years, ten years down the line. So yeah, that's something you really need to look out for, um, is how far down the line you think you see yourself wearing the piece. And last but not least, probably my most essential uh, longevity piece that I wear so much is this Stotts Ballet uh, hoodie here. I wear this literally so much, no matter what time of year it is, summer, wear it at night, um, winter, I wear it almost every day. If you see me at school, if you go to my school, you'll see that I wear this hoodie all the time. It's just so comfortable and it keeps me warm as well. Nice thick hoodie that I see myself wearing probably for my whole life. I'll never get rid of this thing. It means a lot to me. Um, very clean print and just a 10 out of 10 hoodie in my opinion. Another thing with this, you can wear it up. So you can wear it down, you know. The perfect is essential fit. I could wear this hoodie with the Levi's jeans with the Andy Milamister derbies and I'm good to go. I can wear that six days out of the week if I wanted to. Just a nice comfortable way of styling. So yeah, that's all I've really got today. Um, just something I kind of wanted to touch on and give you guys a little tip um, when it comes to the sale season shopping and just shopping in general. So yeah, I really hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you wanna see more videos like this or anything like that, uh, please let me know in the comments. If you wanna see something in particular about menswear or something like that, let me know in the comments. Oh yeah, I'm also doing a Q&A, um, an end of year Q&A. So if you wanna ask me a question for the Q&A, please leave it in the comments. I will for sure get it to the video. Yeah, other than that, I hope you all have a nice day and peace out.